What's up guys, in this video I'm going to show you how to make working wall buys in Fortnite Creative. So for this wall buy you're going to need a few things. Obviously you're going to need a weapon, you're going to need the item placer which was recently added, you're going to need a conditional button and an item grantor. All of these can be found in the devices section of the creative tab. And obviously you're going to need a wall or a table to put it on. So the first thing you're going to want to do is grab your item placer and place it down. Then you're just going to want to throw your weapon in it, whatever it is. I'm choosing an assault rifle. Then what you're going to want to do is to go into the item placer and change these settings. Then you're going to want to place down your conditional button. This is what's going to be used for the player to actually purchase the weapon. And you're going to want to change all of these settings here. Two things of note here is for the interaction text, try and put the name of the weapon and also how much it's going to cost. For here, I have the rifle costing 100 gold. And for the missing items text, I just put you don't have enough gold along with the same thing I have up here for the interaction text. Lastly, you're going to want to bring out your item grantor, place it down, and change these settings right here. And while you have your item grantor out, make sure to place the weapon, the same weapon you put in the item placer, into the item grantor. Going back to the conditional button, what you're going to want to do is put whatever currency you want to have to be able to purchase the weapon. So obviously I'm using gold, so all you have to do is throw it in. And in the device, you can change the amount it costs right here under key items required. I have mine set to 100. Now to put it all together, all you have to do is grab your item placer, put it against whatever wall or table you have, make sure it's flush against the wall, something like that. Then you want to grab your conditional button and place it over your item placer. So when the player interacts with it, they'll be touching the conditional button. And lastly, you can take your item grantor and just hide it somewhere. I'm just going to put mine back here. And there you go guys, you have your working wall buy. As you can see, I have my gold in here, and if I drop it, I'm not able to purchase it. It says I don't have enough gold. And if I pick up my gold again, I'm able to buy it. And yeah. And yeah guys, that's the end of the video. According to my last video, 68% of you guys weren't subscribed. So if you like the content I make, be sure to subscribe. And while you're at it, like the video. Make sure to follow my Twitter. And I'll see you guys in the next one. Peace.